Happy Tuesday. We're here at the second house of the Urban Chicken Coop Bike Tour. And uh, we're going to show this beautiful backyard here in Peaceburg, Pennsylvania. So there they've got some a mushroom log. Got some plants growing here. Got a beautiful duck. Got some lettuce growing, I believe. Over yonder are the chickens, which we can go visit. Some beautiful sculptures. This is in Highland Park area. I recommend ducks just for the pure. And I used to, my there, there's a satisfaction. I've determined that uh, chickens are essentially the cats of the <laughs> home fowl <laughs> pet in the world, insofar like as really feed us to pretend to exist. Oh, yeah, that's a special breed. And, uh, <laughs> whereas the duck is just, you, you know, where did you go? Chickens. Where did you go? Where are you? And <laughs> she, she loves to see you in sight. She wants to look after you. Did you see the picture of the duck with the little black feet? I had to bring it home. Oh, that's right. No, that's the one she wanted to see. I'm Let's sorry. go visit these chickens. <laughs> yeah, my husband got that as a, so like a, as a threat. <laughs> Somebody down the street was thrown about. I mean, like. Ah, uh, there's the chicken coop. Isn't that neat? They have broccoli. I'll let you get in. That's a random thing for someone to be throwing away. Like, right? <laughs> 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 right down the street. Ah, you like that? <laughs> this is right here in the city. So did they come out here and walk Pretty cool, huh? Yeah, we nice. have them out here all the time. Well, it's usually about an hour before sunset. They'll come out and they'll scratch around. Hello, the chickens. Bed. How's it going back here? So these chickens stay in here for the whole winter and they're perfectly fine. The other house said they got almost a dozen eggs a day from their chickens. And uh, it's just really incredible that you can have friendly animals hanging out in your backyard and they give delicious food. Excuse me. Well, no, they don't even have to huddle together. They fluff up their feathers. They're really hardy animals. They're really hardy animals. They walk around in the snow. I have a friend in Lawrenceville who has chickens, and look, her chicken does not go inside to roost, even in the winter. She'll get snowed on. It's amazing. Yeah, it's really funny. <laughs> wow. Hi. And what do you do with the stuff that you clean out of? Do you compost it? I compost it. I sometimes I just have buckets of like the chicken, uh, the the chicken manure and the wood shavings. Because what I do is every day I poop or scoop. Because uh -huh. okay. they tend to uh, neat little piles, and so then I just put that in a bucket and let it age. A while, and then I can put it on the garden. Beautiful. Yeah. So it's recycling all of the yeah. all of the waste. Yeah. Waste just becomes food for something else. I've got amazing soil. Yeah. Did you, did you see the duck? I did see the duck. Does the duck? Hard to miss the duck. It's forming over there right now. Yeah. Sorry. Uh, I'm gonna go check them out. Save some for the noon show. <laughs> <laughs> so where did the duck come from? Shelley brought it home from the PASA conference. There was a guy, a you know, sustainable agriculture conference, and some guy was, you know, had birds there. And at the end of the um, end of the event, they were giving them away. So strangely, this fell into her pocket and turned up on my doorstep, and and was adorable and pooped on me regardless. <laughs> All right. Well, have a happy Sunday. Check out transitionpgh.org and have a wonderful day.